So it's got some uh, Drastic G business cards. Do you want one? Check it. If you're new to my channel and you want to see me find some treasure and you're not subscribed already, subscribe and click the bell to get notifications of all my latest videos. So Jersey's got some amazing beaches, but almost all of them have got machine gun posts and bunkers all around them, left over from the Second World War. But these weren't built by the British, these were built by the Germans who occupied the island in 1940. So the island of Jersey is proudly British, but between 1940 and 1945 it was occupied by the Nazi Germans. So it's estimated that over a million cubic feet of concrete was used on the defences on the Channel Islands. So on the west coast, this is where they thought the British was going to attack. So Hitler ordered the wall to be built, which was over 20 foot tall, curves at the top, got six feet of sand on the bottom. So this tower was an MP1 tower, and that was used as a rangefinder to direct enemy fire onto ships. So that was just a quick bit of history on the Isle of Jersey. So now to do a bit of detecting, see what we can find on the beaches. So it looks like I found my first coin in uh, Jersey. Not too sure what it is, um, but I'll get it cleaned up, post a picture. Uh, find a little car. <laughs> Cute. Uh, kids little car. Well, this, uh, this view is amazing. Wow, we've got a swimmer. Let's find another coin. Cool, okay. Who must have done that? like a twenty feet. Another jersey five pence. So yeah, this beach is a little gold mine, finding loads of little coins. Um, I think I've got another coin here. Is it a coin or is it a ball cap? Nah, uh, looks like a... Uh, don't know what it is. I'd like a little rivet. Or a little islet or something. Well, I thought it was a coin. Oh well. So, but look at the view. That's the uh, that's the anti-tank wall that was built by the Germans when they invaded uh, the island of Jersey, and it pretty much goes all the way down the beach, which I've already been metal detecting. So now I'm just going to whip my way back down um, before the light fades and see what else I can find. <laughs> what a toy car. <laughs> That's well cool. Fifty P. Fifty P. Oh, got another coin. This one looks like a tempe. Yep, British tempe. Doing pretty good today on the uh, on the coins. Found my first pound coin with the uh, macro cruiser. Well tough with that. Got loads of money today, so hopefully some of it's old as well. But, um, we'll get back. It's getting late now, so I'm going to get back and uh, see what we've got. So this is after. The first day of uh, metal detecting in Jersey. So we've got a Jersey penny, we've got um, quite a few Jersey 5Ps, 
These I wasn't too sure of, um, but they're definitely uh, five Ps. Got a couple of jersey ten Ps, um, twenty Ps, but only one jersey one. A jersey fifty P, um, quite a few English ones, and then a pound coin. So happy with all of this. Then bottle opener and a funky little toy car. I actually got a bigger toy car as well, but um, I left it on the beach for the side, on the side. So yeah, not bad for the first uh, metal detecting in Jersey. So let's see what I can get tomorrow. For an adventure. This place is absolutely gorgeous. The size of the houses. So I thought it was uh, like an old uh, field gun here or something. It's definitely uh, qualifications. I think that's an artillery gun mount. That's cool. Finding loads of money around these bushes. So yeah, I found the 50p. Yeah, 50p and then the pound, so not too bad. This place is absolutely gorgeous, but it's really windy. So, I'm not too sure what this is. I'm thinking it's like an old fishing weight. Uh, it's got a line attached to it. I don't know what it's doing up here though, because there's like a, like a canyon down there. Um, that's a footpath um, to the gun ba uh, battery. But I'm not too sure what... Just found uh, that in the ground with the uh, Macro Motor Cruiser. Looks really old. I wonder what the date is on it. Do these have dates on? Not too sure, but it's not often you see a glass bottle, especially that size. So yeah, Coke. Found another cool little bottle. Oh, it's a Bell's whiskey bottle <laughs> in the shape of a bell. Not seen one of them before. Yeah, I don't know what this is. Uh, it's definitely interesting. But, yeah, God knows what it is. Uh, it feels really soft though. Bit, bits of it are breaking off. So I'll try and clean it up when I get back and uh, see what it is. Just been digging a big hole. And uh, yeah, it's giving off a good signal. So, this is what I uncovered. Took some digging out. It's just a massive piece of steel. It's just got rocks either molded into it or encrusted into it. Look, don't know what it is, but it's big. <laughs> This is free case. Go in the uh, German bunkers at night time. Wow. Crazy. They're a lot different than the uh, British ones.
Yeah. If I'm going big, I'm going home. In a box. For it to say. Little grip. I'm not going off. You got a, you got a knee? I can get you off here quicker. There isn't much to get a good hand grip on this one. Oh! 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 Hey, what you looking at, fool? <laughs> you looking at me? You looking at me? Burr.